Ready to face the challenges of farming, where you have no control over production or pricing, farmers tend to have a strong faith. WCIA 3's ag reporter Sue Ellis has more in this morning's Harvest Heritage Report. The faith that farmers have is typically inherited. And a good example are the Bergner brothers, who operate a large pork farm at Assumption. I would say one thing that helps keep us together uh, is our faith in God. That's one thing that's really, really kept us tight and inch. We all live within two mile radius of each other, and that's really helped us out. You know, Mom and Dad has grew us up in church and, and really instilled that value in our, in our life. Mike Brunchen's operation near Warrensburg extends over several counties. It doesn't matter if you farm the land for somebody in Florida, Texas, Maryland, which I do presently, but we all farm for the good Lord. And I feel so fortunate to be able to do this job. And uh, it gives me goosebumps. Justin Green farms near Arthur. Faith, family, and farming are, are three big things uh, in our operation. And uh, we have a lot of hungry mouths that we're going to have to feed in this world. And, and it's a... Uh, we have been given the challenge as farmers to, uh, to feed the world in the upcoming e centuries. And Megan Opperman is in line to take over her family farm near Lincoln. I would still like to keep the farm with its faith structure behind it because our belief in God has really helped the farm and I want to keep that a part of it. That's our Harvest Heritage Report on the faith of farmers. I'm Stu Ellis with WCIA3, your local news leader.